Welcome to Just Web Reaction. Today we're going to be looking at money markets. Money markets are markets in which financial instruments with remaining maturities of up to one year are bought and sold. Then we're going to look at liquid assets. So these are assets that may be converted into cash quickly without significant loss of value. And that includes bankers acceptance and treasury bills. Then let us now look at the participants in the money markets. So the main participants in the money markets include commercial banks, central bank, patient schemes, insurance companies, savings and credit cooperatives. Then we also have individuals. So those are the main participants in the money markets. Then let us now look at the instruments in the money market. So money markets instruments include treasury bills, repurchase agreements, negotiable certificate of deposits, commercial paper, then we also have bankers acceptance. So we are going to start with the treasury bills. So these are obligations of the government. They are mainly issued to cover government budget deficit or to refinance maturing government debt. A predetermined quantity of securities is offered for sale. At times it is oversubscribed or undersubscribed. A rate is then determined for the treasury bills. They can be traded in the secondary market. Can also have international bidders and players. Then let us now look at the repurchase agreements. So these are also referred to as the reverse repos. So repos are agreements to sell securities and later to reverse the sale. The transaction commonly involves treasury securities. They are short term overnight. Then let us now look at the negotiable certificates of deposits. A financial instrument issued by a bank documenting a deposit with principal and interest repayable to the barrier at a specific future debt. So that's the negotiable certificates of deposit. Then let us look at the commercial paper. The commercial paper is a short term and secured promissory note issued by corporations and foreign governments. For many large credit worth issuers, commercial paper is a low cost alternative to bank loans. Issuers are able to efficiently raise large amount of funds quickly and without expensive securities and exchange commission. That SEC registration by selling paper either directly or through independent dealers. Then let us now look at the banker's acceptance. So the banker's acceptance is a time draft or post dated instrument payable to a seller of goods or services with payment guaranteed by a bank. So those are the types of the money market instruments. Let us now look at the characteristics of money market instruments. So the first one we have liquidity. So liquidity is the ability to convert an asset into cash with relative easy while not significantly depressing its price in the process. Money market instruments are fixed income securities with short term maturities of a year or less and are extremely liquid. Money market deposit accounts and money market mature funds have high liquidity as depositors may access money by check when they need it. Some money market instruments also permit resale to secondary buyers if the investor needs the principal before maturity. Treasury reviews and some special certificate of deposits fall into this category. Let us now look at the second characteristic which is low default risk. Risk of non-payment of principal or interest must be minimal in order for the security to be considered a safe haven for excess liquidity. Money market securities are the safest investments available with credit ratings that surpass almost all other investment grade debt instruments. The other characteristics we have short term to maturity. The short term to maturity helps to ensure that interest rate changes will not affect the securities market value. Money market securities are designed to meet the short term capital requirements of government and business. Most money market securities mature in less than three months and all mature within one year. Money market instruments such as government funds 
and repurchase agreements exemplifies the short securities of money market securities. They represent significant holdings in most money market funds and typically mature in less than one week. So that's all about the money markets. Where you have questions, please you can put them in the comment section. Don't forget to like this video and also subscribe to our YouTube channel if you have not subscribed yet. I'll meet you next time. Peace and God bless.